right, everyone. Hello and welcome back to the channel. All right, now let me uh, throw a couple of things at you guys before we kick the video off. Whereas uh, I noticed in my last video a few comments in reference to uh, my intro. My intro is too long. Now, uh, I understand that most of you guys want to get right into the, the, the video and so on. But uh, I'm sure most of you guys understand that everybody who's out there uh, uh, channel-wise, everybody, pretty much everybody, uh, has some type of uh, way of uh, expressing their your channel and uh, having an intro before and after uh, your video that you're showcasing or whatsoever it's a I don't know it's a in my opinion it's a, just a harmless way of uh, expressing your channel okay welcome back Kata is something that I grew up with and as I always start my intro with welcome back to the channel I figured hey you know two and two uh, equals four okay now uh, I know before I uh, added the music and so on it was a 10 second uh, uh, YouTube logo with like share and subscribe and again I will try to uh, uh, come to a common ground where on some videos that uh, are long I will um uh, cut down on the intro, but uh, uh, the ideal of the intro, again, I say, is to express myself in a, uh, my channel in a certain way, as well as to thank my channel members, which are, to me, the most important thing I have, okay? Uh, so I really don't mean any harm. I ask that you uh, bear with me with the intro. 51 seconds, I cannot really see how much harm that is doing, but uh, let's also keep in mind that we have the fast forward. Fast forward, guys, okay, because I do the same thing now. I, I check out a couple of channels on a daily, and uh, uh, these individuals have two, three-minute uh, intros that I just, whoops, right to the video. <laughs> anyway, uh, uh, so bear with me, okay, guys? I'll work with you guys. I'm not trying to be a pain in anybody's butt. I truly am grateful for, uh, for you guys that uh, take the time out to watch my videos. Now, let me also mention that uh, in my last live stream, which, again, I'm going to say it went a Lot better than what I expected. I'm very grateful for you guys that took the time out. Um, I made comments. Not only did I want to uh, introduce an officer, and you guys did a very good job of picking his brain, and there's a lot more questions I'm assuming you guys would like, uh, but I also uh, mentioned that I was trying to get a reporter, a reporter that in that video that lard-ass Anthony X was bashing, and um, I had hit her up on Twitter as well as uh, I called her job, okay, and uh, spoke to the operator, and let's just say she communicated with me yesterday, here's the email that she sent me, uh, she appreciates uh, uh, my persistence in uh, trying to get her to uh, <laughs> come on the live stream and uh, pretty much uh, she's going to stick to writing in print. She was very nice. I spoke to her on the phone. Uh, uh, that's her platform. That's her thing. Or, uh, writing uh, in the newspaper. Uh, would you believe it? That some people just don't I don't know. They're not YouTubers. They don't. They're not into the videos. Uh, they're old school. You know. I mean, believe it or not, I know some people that have uh, never been on the internet. That's crazy, right? Knowing that we uh, computers is pretty much running everything in this damn world. Everything is more uh, computer related now. That it's hard to swallow when you come across somebody who who says, uh, "I've never to this day been on a computer." But it is what it is. So again, um, she did tell me that uh, she was going to make a follow-up, uh, being that that knucklehead had uh, uh, made a video on her, that she uh, was going to make a follow-up uh, article in her paper, and uh, apparently she would be delighted if I uh, wanted to share her uh, forthcoming column on uh, Thursday. So Friday, I will be giving you uh, what she put out there on that lard-ass Anthony X. Okay? Now, uh, uh, let me also uh, get into the video part of uh, the video that I, uh, I'm going to showcase comes from that particular officer that was on the live stream, Andre Sloan. Now, uh, for those of you that uh, took the time out in effort to uh, join me in the live, you uh, probably noticed that Eli as well as this knucklehead who calls himself Easy Camera. Uh, that's the guy, the women beater. The guy that uh, he feels like a man now because he knocked a female out, okay? You remember that? And let me show you that clip there so I can refresh your memory on this knucklehead. I was waving at her like this, look. I was like, take a picture. Take a picture, you mad? She's gonna wait till I leave and try to back up. She's mad. 
Let's <laughs> no, go back up too. She can park not even right there because there's a parking spot right there. Can, she can't block that parkway. So you know what I'm saying? And she's blocking the bike lane now. Like you gotta do better. If you're gonna do better, do better. We run plates and everything. We read everybody. We support. We expose everyone. She really gonna sit here and follow me. But now she good. She 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 moved from there. That's all that matters. You know what I'm saying? Because now somebody's safer. She an EMT, so she should knew better. If you knew better, you do better. Exactly. If you knew better, you would do better. Exactly. I'm doing right. I'm, I know my I'm, lord. I'm one of the heroes that everyone thanks every day for saving people's lives. So yeah, report me in front of your million, million followers so that people can leave your page. That's right. There you go. There when they can leave my page, there are more people they love you right on now. My side than on your side. I save people's lives. What do you do? Humiliate people on your page. People that save people's lives. Okay, keep on, keep on. I love it. Keep Go on. Go fuck yourself, you fucking asshole. This is an EMT worker too. Look at her. She coming over here. This is an EMT worker. This is an EMT worker. That's you assault. don't have the fucking right to fucking record. That's me. assault. Yo, call the police before I rock this. I'm about to slap this bitch. Y'all saw that? You saw that? I'm about to rock you. You're you're go ahead, touch me again. Me. Touch me again. Touch, touch me again. I'm gonna rock you. Business. Touch me again. I'm gonna. Bitch, don't spit at me. Hey, Fuck out of here. She spit on me. You gonna spit on me? You gonna check me to my effect? Yo, dude, you knocked her out. I don't give a fuck, bro. Well, there you go. He doesn't give enough. He doesn't give enough that he uh, put hands on a female. Uh, not to mention that uh, he was the one that started all this BS uh, uh, because he wanted to play concerned citizen uh, telling this young lady that uh, she's causing a danger by parking by a hydrant. Okay? Now, I think if you guys got to watch this video from the very beginning, then you know that uh, he was just out there walking the streets just like Eli does and uh, uh, looking for a victim and unfortunately that lady was the victim now uh again he want to play concerned citizen by warning her about the hydrant being parked at a hydrant come on now i think most of us here would have told that person maybe once or twice the most hey you're gonna get a ticket there and it's not right to be parked by a hydrant and that's it Go about your business, but not him. He felt that uh, he felt that it was his duty to enforce it. Let's go. You got to get out of there. And and then again, I uh, want to take the license plate number down. And and you know they, we all know these frauders. The shit that they do just to uh, uh, egg the person on. You know and. Uh, again, I don't want anybody to think that I'm trying to justify uh, her smacking him or spitting. I understand what she did was wrong, okay? But to uh, hit a female, that that alone, I don't agree with. And then, uh, if you took my, uh, if you took the time to watch uh, my take on this video, then I pointed out that uh, when uh, after the spitting in the face deal, she turned around to walk back to her vehicle, and that's when he struck her. He struck her while she was facing the opposite direction. And to me, that's a bitch move. Only a bitch would do something like that. Hit that person when they're not even looking at you, while they had their back to you. Uh, the bitch in him came out now, okay? And again, I think we could all say uh, they do this shit to get a reaction. And when they get the reaction and it ain't what they're looking for, oh, uh, all of a sudden, it's either call the cops, I want them arrested, or they want to put hands on them. And that's why I say, guys, if you guys have been paying attention to my videos or the videos of the frauders in New York, I'm telling you guys, it's getting dangerous now. This frauding thing is uh, not a harmless thing like some of you guys may think it is. These guys are not only targeting law enforcement, public employees, they are now targeting the people. We, the people. And I understand that some of you may feel that I'm over-dramatizing crap, but listen, that's the way I see it. I watch these videos just like you do, and when I'm editing these videos, in my opinion, I'm focusing on the shit that comes out of their mouth, and uh, you heard the uh, comment, I think I didn't cut it out, I cut out a lot out of this, uh, just this little portion I wanted to point out here, but he made comments that this is the shit we do, we expose everyone, everyone, okay? so. You know, listen to me. These guys, in a sense, what he's saying, we're not just targeting law enforcement and public employees. We're targeting everyone. 
Okay, so you guys take it the way you want to take it. And I'm asking you guys to go on Andre's uh, channel, which I will put a link to his channel, and give him some support, guys, okay? Because he is a good friend. He is a good cop. And these frauditors, okay, like I said, this individual here want to record some of my live stream and, uh, and boast to his subscribers, look, uh, we got a dirty cop here. Look at the comments that he makes. Now, this comes from criminals, damn it. Criminals, okay? But now well, here he is boasting to his subscribers we need uh, internal affairs to uh, uh, take a look at Andre Sloan. And I would not forgive myself if something like that were to happen. And again, these frauditors play dirty. And that's why I hate to say it because I know some of you guys feel that uh, I'm stooping to their level, damn it. But you got to fight fire with fire. You want to play dirty? Then I'm going to play dirty too, okay? So give Andre Sloan some support. And let me show you the video that he put out there, guys. And um, I wouldn't mind if you guys would take the time out to go on Easy uh, Cameras uh, uh, video that he put out on uh, Andre here and give him some of your input, guys, okay? And I'm telling you, we got to take this a lot more serious than we're taking it, guys. So let me know your thoughts on the video, guys, and I will uh, see you in my next video. Whoop, whoop. That's the sound of the police. Whoop, whoop. That's the sound of the beast. Whoop, whoop. That's the sound of the police. Whoop, whoop. That's the yes. sound of the beast. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. We did a live stream a couple nights ago with Familia TV, and while we were doing that, a frauditor by the name of EZ Cameras On decided to come along and play around with us there during the uh, live stream and kind of mess with us a little bit, and he even filmed part of it. I want to show you this. Because it's kind of interesting. Easy cameras on thinks I'm a dirty cop just because I would do my job? How does that work, Easy? Or shall we say Mr. Crespo? How does that work that I'm a dirty cop just because I would do my job? Makes no sense to me. So, ladies and gentlemen, let's get ready to board that crazy train of frauditing. And see what Mr. Crespo had to say about Andre Sloan being a dirty cop. All aboard! <laughs> Verbal abuse from the frauditors, and that is they don't have to put up with it. I think it may go on department policy. Somebody please tell me if that's what my voice sounds like coming over the live stream or is uh, Easy Cameras On got a messed up system of some sort that that's what it made me sound like. What you're allowed to do and what you're not allowed to do. <clears throat> I believe this guy's a cop. My opinion is I'm not going to stand there and take it. I'm going to arrest you for disorderly conduct. Um, I'm old school. Um, I've been doing this since the 80s. You're doing this since the 80s, so he's a cop from the 80s. You may not get prosecuted, and you may be out of jail in two hours, but I'm going to I'm going to make sure to ruin you know two hours of your time because I'm going to cuff you up. I'm going to take you to jail, and then they let him go from there. So, familiar is trying to come back in, but I don't. Internal affairs. This is on Familiar's TV, and if you could. Find his IP address, find out who this cop is. He is speaking dirty. He's fucking corrupt. All right, Mr. Crespo, how am I speaking dirty? Where in any of that conversation did I say something dirty? Did I say something dirty because you don't like it? That's what I'm thinking, Mr. Crespo. You know what? Just because I would do my job, that makes me a dirty cop, huh? Well, I hope IA finds me. And I hope I can have a conversation with them about frauditors like you. And then we can all come to an agreement that people like you are ruining this for the rest of America. The rest of us who want our rights. 
you're not doing it for rights. You're not doing it for any kind of education. You're not trying to hold police accountable. No, sir. You know what you're doing? You're being a fucktard. That's what you're doing. You're being the skell that you are. You just, you're a criminal. I, oh, I got to find out your name and your birth date, man, because I'm going to run you and I'm going to, I'm going to find out your criminal history because I know there has to be one. You're pissed off because the cops won't let you do what you want to do when you want to do it. That's why you're doing what you're doing. Yeah, I need a, the Turtle Fans Nationwide need to investigate this. So that's it, ladies and gentlemen. That's, that's, uh. Easy camera on. I got uh, some information that his name might be Alex Crespo or Axel Crespo. So if anybody can verify that for me, please let me know. And uh, in the comments down below, let me know. Do you think I'm a dirty cop? Do you think I'm dirty because I do my job? If somebody was on the sidewalk yelling and screaming at me for a prolonged period of time and I arrested them for disorderly conduct, is that does that make me a dirty cop? I, I just, I can't fathom that, he, well, you know, hey, he's a criminal. What do you expect? What do you expect from a criminal? So, but in the comments down below, let me know. Do you think I'm a dirty cop? Because I would do my job. Also, you know, let me know what you think of this video. Uh, hit the likes, uh, like button or the uh, thumbs up button, whatever it is there. Uh, and uh, let me know if you like the video. Uh, just a quick one I put together after uh, finding his yesterday. Um, I wanted to get it out as quick as possible. Um, I'm hoping he comes back and, and he's got a rebuttal. I just, you know, I, I, I want to know where his mind is on this. But, you know, uh, thank you all for watching. You know, uh, do, do me a favor. Tell your friends and your family and your enemies and, you know, your semi-enemies and your co-defendants and, you know, people you hang out with. Tell everybody you know about the channel. I'd like to see it explode. Uh, I've gone um, 1,500 and something subscribers now. I'd like to get up over 2,000 here within a month or so, and uh, who knows, you guys are the ones that can make it happen, and I really appreciate each and every one of you. I appreciate the new uh, subscribers that have come on in the last month, I think 100 or 200 in the last uh, couple of months, and, uh, you know, I, uh, I appreciate all the old uh, subscribers. You guys are the ones that help keep the channel going, and you're the ones that help, uh, you know, uh, keep moving the numbers upwards, and that's what I like to see, so... All right, let's, uh, let's uh, see what Mr. Crespo uh, has to say, and y'all take care, and we'll see you soon.